join me as I dive into 12 powerful Bible verses about love that will uplift and comfort you when you need it most. Love is a fundamental aspect of the Christian faith, and it's what sets us apart from the rest of the world. In a world filled with hate, anger, and division, the Bible's message of love is a beacon of hope and comfort. It's what gives us strength in the darkest of times and helps us overcome even the most daunting challenges. Life can be overwhelming and we all face challenges that can leave us feeling hopeless and alone. Maybe you're going through a difficult breakup, struggling with anxiety or depression, or dealing with the loss of a loved one. Whatever it is, it's easy to feel like you're carrying the weight of the world on your shoulders. But here's the thing. You're not alone. The Bible is filled with verses that remind us of God's unwavering love for us and how that love can transform our lives. It's a love that's unconditional, unrelenting, and always available. And it's a love that can bring comfort, peace, and hope to even the darkest of situations. As we navigate the ups and downs of life, it's easy to lose sight of what's truly important. We get caught up in our own problems and forget that we're not alone. But the Bible reminds us that we're part of a bigger story, one that's centered on God's love for us. Let's take a look at some of the most powerful Bible verses about love that can bring comfort and strength to our lives. These verses remind us of God's unwavering love for us and how that love can transform our lives in ways we never thought possible. The first verse is 1 Corinthians 13, 4, 7, which says, Love is patient, love is kind, it does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud, it does not dishonor others, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrong. This verse reminds us that love is not just a feeling, but an action that involves sacrificing our own desires for the benefit of others. The second verse is John 3.16, which says, For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. This verse reminds us of the ultimate act of love that God demonstrated through the sacrifice of Jesus Christ. The third verse is Romans 8.37, 39, which says, no, in all these things, we are more than conquerors through him who loved us. For I am convinced that neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, neither the present nor the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, nor anything else in all creation will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. This verse reminds us that nothing can separate us from God's love no matter what we face in life. The fourth verse is 1 John 4, 19, which says, we love because he first loved us. This verse reminds us that our love for others is only possible because of God's love for us. The fifth verse is Ephesians 3, 17, 19, which says, and I pray that you being rooted and established in love may have power together with all the Lord's holy people to grasp how wide and long and high and deep is the love of Christ, and to know this love that surpasses knowledge, that you may be filled to the measure of all the fullness of God. This verse reminds us of the enormity of God's love for us, which surpasses our human understanding. The sixth verse is Psalm 136, one which says, Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his love endures forever. This verse reminds us to give thanks to God for his love, which endures forever. The seventh verse is Jeremiah 31, three which says, the Lord has appeared of old unto me saying, yea, I have loved thee with an everlasting love. Therefore with loving kindness have I drawn thee. This verse reminds us of God's everlasting love for us. The eighth verse is Romans five, Eight, which says, God demonstrates his own love for us in this. While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. This verse reminds us of God's demonstration of love through the sacrifice of Jesus Christ. The ninth verse is Galatians 2.20, which says, 
I have been crucified with Christ and I no longer live, but Christ lives in me. The life I now live in the body, I live by faith in the Son of God, who loved me and gave himself for me. This verse reminds us that Christ lives in us and that he loved us and gave himself for us. The 10th verse is 1 Peter 4, 8, which says, Above all, love each other deeply, because love covers a multitude of sins. This verse reminds us to love each other deeply, just as God loves us. The 11th verse is Colossians 3, 14, which says, And over all these virtues, put on love, which binds them all together in perfect unity. This verse reminds us to put on love, which binds all virtues together in perfect unity. The 12th verse is 2 Corinthians 5.14, which says, For Christ's love compels us, because we are convinced that one died for all, and therefore all died. This verse reminds us that Christ's love compels us to live for him, because he died for us. One verse that always stands out to me is John 15.13 which says, greater love has no one than this to lay down one's life for one's friends. This verse reminds us that Jesus's love for us is so great that he was willing to lay down his own life for us. That's a love that's hard to comprehend, but it's a love that transforms our lives in ways we never thought possible. In a world that's full of hate and anger, this verse reminds us that there's a different way to live. It reminds us that love is not just a feeling, but an action that involves sacrificing our own desires for the benefit of others. And it reminds us that Jesus' love for us is so great that he was willing to lay down his own life for us. As we reflect on these 12 Bible verses about love, I hope you're reminded of the transformative power of God's love. I hope you're comforted by the knowledge that you're not alone and that God's love is always available to you. And I hope you're inspired to live a life that's characterized by love, just as Jesus lived. Thanks for joining me on this journey through 12 powerful Bible verses about love. I hope these verses have brought comfort and strength to your life. If you have a favorite Bible verse about love, please share it with me in the comments below. And if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe for more faith-boosting content.